M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So I had a question about this new app that's out called SDR Control for iOS and Mac. And the question was, can you use it on a Mac? Well, yes, you definitely can. And here are, is the website for the app. And let's have a quick look down it. As you can see, uh, it has excellent controls for the 705, 7610 and the 9700. And no wires needed. Works, works via... Uh, Wi-Fi or, or LAN. So let's have a look. FT8 integrated. FT8 has never been easier. Auto mode, auto CQ, auto logging, filters, and a display on map. Integrated logbook as well. Keep going down. Whenever you want, from anywhere you want. So you can control your radio at home um, when you're out and about or flying around uh, the planet. So that's pretty good, isn't it? So you get all these additional extras here. Uh, you can see the little tabs here. The requirements are SDR control for icon can be used with the following transceivers. So 705 and the 9700 and the 7610 do need a LAN cable connection. USB connectors or other transceivers are not supported. The app runs on any iPad that is running at least iOS 15. There is no other relevant requirement. You can use the cheaper, slower iPad available from my Apple or the newest iPads Pro on any screen size. And more information, there's some questions here. I am already using and have paid for your app. My Mac, do I have to pay again if I like to use your iOS version on my iPad? And then all answers here to all the questions. And there's a, a there is a video there as well. I know Tech Minds has made a excellent video. I'll just show you a couple of them. Ham Radio DX. Here's another one. Here. SDR control for iOS. So plenty of interest in this. It's such a user friendly, you know, program basically, and very appealing. Now it does have a cost to it. If I just um, minimise this. This is the the Mac page for it, which is looks pretty identical to me. There you are. Have a look at that. Mac page there, and then we've got this window here for purchase. So it's $44.99. And there you go. Once you've got it, you've got it for life information. So yeah, have a look, tell me what you think, if you think this is worth having. It's a very, cause the problem with um, programs like the RSBA1, I would say, is it's quite hard to set up. It's, and, it's, um, and it's, you know, the, I've got the RSBA1, I like the RSBA1 software, but for me, it's, it's, it can be a bit of a pain at times, where this seems very straightforward. You just, you know... Connect, Every, all the hard work's been done by Marcus, if you ask me, and you can just connect and use it, for, and from anywhere in the world. Um, and of course, you get backup and support as well. So check it out, uh, see what you think. I've got the 705 here, uh, and 73, thanks for watching my video, all the best.